Hello everyone, um, welcome to another news time. This is about the EA play that went down, and to be honest, I don't know why I watch these because they always send me to sleep. I don't think EA has had a well had a good one of these in a while, but let's just talk about what they were on about during the EA Play Live first um, I think it's the CEO Andrew Wilson I think his name is came on to talk a bit about Black Lives Matter and everything that's going on in the world right now uh, we all already know about that, so I don't know why he did that. Uh, I will say that Greg Miller did well. He is, he knows how to do these. It's just EA never has the games to back it up. So the first game they talked about was Apex Legends and the season five that's coming out. Yeah, do I need to say any more? probably know what's coming uh, new well new stuff I don't really play Apex I don't get the old um, what you call them I, f I forget what they're called give me a second uh, Battle Royale I don't get them um, so I'm probably never going to play one but they talked about this next season which has started then they just basically told us that the games are coming to Steam which we already knew um, is there anything else to say to that EA games are coming to Steam anyone that didn't know and is watching this now knows and then they talked about the EA originals which three of their indie partners are creating games again um, and they are It Takes Two Lost in Random and Rocket Arena none of them looked like it was they were going to be any good if I'm being honest It Takes Two it Takes Two is from the people that brought you Tale of Two Sons and The Way Out. So that might get some people behind it, but the other two, eh. Then what everyone basically tuned in for was uh, Star Wars Squadrons. Um, there was a trailer and there was meant to be some gameplay it has a release date of the 2nd of October this year it has a single player campaign now the gameplay they showed off was in like a trailer fashion it weren't really someone playing the game I'd say it was well someone must have been playing it beforehand and then they recorded over it and cut out the rubbish that they didn't want you to see it weren't live gameplay they had to speak about the sports games I don't know why but they do in every one because uh, we all know they're coming so and then at the end they hit you with uh, the fact that Skate is coming back Skate 4 it's, they just basically said Skate's coming back so if you're a Skate fan something to look forward to but my guess is that will not be out for a while 
2022, maybe. That's all I saw. Short. I wouldn't say sweet. I'd say it's probably going to be the worst thing we see of this sort of structure. And yeah. Uh, if there was anything that I missed, please tell us below because I was falling asleep. I finished work, came home, found out it was on, watched the video, and uh, I might have, like, passed out or something in parts. But that was everything that I saw in EA Play. Uh, yeah, if you're looking forward to any of them, please let us know, and I hope to see you in the next video.